Get blasted. Oh, yes. Slimeized him. Oh my gosh, that was great. What is going on, geeks? Unite the Clans here, back in your life with another episode of Fallout 4. Thank you so much for watching the series so far. Uh, last episode ended emotionally for me. I decided to free these four synths and turned on this courser. And now my quest is to go speak to father, my son, Sean, in the ruins of CIT. And in the fight, a stray shotgun shell, or some of the spray from my gun, my new gun, hit her B257 and killed her. Yes, she was a synth, but I wasn't ready for her to die. I'd just given her her life back. Um, we are off to meet Sean. Hey, is the fighting over? Right, there was a giant battle happening above us. And holy crap, there's a lot of dead bodies here. I would love to loot this place. I'm going to have to come back and do it because we are on a quest, guys, and I feel like we are nearing the end of this game. I'm hoping we are, to be honest, because there is a lot left to play, but um, there's a lot that I want to play on my own away from uh, the series. So I'm hoping we can get to a point where I can end the series without having burnt all my bridges. Fallout 4 is an amazing game, one of the best of the year, and one that I really want to experience to the max, but I'm kind of tapped on making episodes. The, t the end of this series is definitely coming. Um, because there's no way I can kill... I just can't do it. I can't kill off the railroad. They have missions I want to do with them. I can't kill off the Brotherhood. There are missions I want to do with them. I'm definitely not killing off the Institute. That's my son. Oh, right. And, uh... And then there's the Minutemen. I don't know if they're even here. But everybody is shooting everybody and nobody is shooting me. And all I have to do is go talk to Sean, Sean, right? In the ruins. I'm not ready to pick a side here. I mean, I, I suppose I could kill some synths, but I'm about to go meet Sean. Let's, um, let's get the hell out of here. Um, I'm here to see Sean. Sounds like super mutants versus synths? I don't know. I'm gonna see if we can do our best to avoid it. Uh, I don't really understand how this is where I'm supposed to find Sean. It doesn't feel like somewhere he would be. Every time we've ever met him has been in a gorgeous, clean, beautiful room of the Institute itself. Okay, good. We found a staircase that gets us... He's still above us. Okay. Yes. There you go. Maybe this battle... I don't know why there's... Yeah. Okay. Get up there. Not sure what to expect, guys. That is... Sean. And, um... Moments ago, at the end of last episode, we opted to free some, um, synths of his. I don't know if we're walking into a trap or what, but this is a very strange place to meet a man that we have only seen inside the secret underground you know, institute. In all my years, I've never set foot outside the institute. That's what I'm saying, Not man. Once, since the day they brought me here, I've never had a reason. But now, 
This just confirms the truth I've always known. The Commonwealth is dead. There's no future here. That's BS. The only hope for humanity lies below. Shh, no. I so wish I had had an opportunity to teach my son. It's hard to even think of him as that looking at him, but... It's not so bad, really. People manage. It's very, perhaps. very true. But at a cost too great to be worth What does that mean? Standing here, I'm reminded of how fortunate I am that I was spared a life in this wasteland. I know that to you, I was kidnapped from that vault. Yes. In truth, the Institute rescued no. me. Both of us. Really. No. 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 They left me on ice for 60 years. They yeah. did. And for good reason. I was the perfect candidate. An infant with uncorrupted DNA. But if something were to go wrong, if I died, well, the Institute realized a contingency plan was prudent. Another source of pre-war DNA, preferably related to their primary subject. And yet again... It only made sense that my parents should fill that role. Yet again, evidence of how the Institute so treats kept alive and safe sentient the beings vault. as property. I'll admit, when I had you released from Vault 111, I had no expectations that you'd survive out here in all this. To not only do so, he but let me out to find me, to infiltrate the institute itself. Extraordinary. He let me out. So it was you. You let me out. Yes. I always wondered. It was my decision. Wondered how that Certainly happened. It was no longer necessary to keep you suspended. I. Well, I suppose I wanted to see what would happen. An experiment of sorts. Right. I had no idea what kind of man you were, you see. Would the Commonwealth corrupt you? As it has everything else. Would you even survive? Perhaps most curious to me. Would you, after all this time, attempt to find me? And now I know the answer. That's all this is to you? I... All I am to you? Just another experiment? No, that's not all. I, I, I might be but done still, with this kid. I'm glad it turned out the way it did. Soon, I hope... I hope you'll understand. Everything I've done has been for the future. A future which I hope is not in jeopardy after recent events. What future? Bunker you hoard your resources. Well for us. Would you care to explain what happened? The people out here need the resources that you have. I don't answer to you. But I'm not afraid of you. I made a choice. I let the synths go free. Why? Why would you do something so... so stupid? It was the right thing to do, Sean. There's yeah. no moral choice to be made here. This was such a simple task. I just don't understand. I know you're capable of handling yourself. How can I expect you to represent the Institute if this sort represent of Represent the Institute? Since when? What if I don't want to represent the Institute? Have you thought about that? To be quite honest, no, I hadn't considered that. It would be such a poor decision on your part. You are not I my not father. I have given it much thought. It's my son. So where does this leave us? I can't walk I away from here. I need to be sure here. I can count on you going forward. I had hoped we could be something like a family again. I hope you shared our vision for the future. I hope you can share one no of mine. For sentimentality, father. If you are not with us, then you are against us. Whatever you do going forward, do not interfere with the Institute's plans. I hope... I hope you can find some amount of peace. 
<laughs> I dreamed of you as an adult for so long. Here you are. And I'm so disappointed. Goodbye, father. I had no idea how this was going to end coming in here, guys. No idea how this was going to end. I just answered as... God, get that level up off my face. I'm trying to do a conclusion. Get this quest out of here. God dang. Good lord. Jesus Christ. How many quests right now? Uh-huh. Quests failed and quests completed, new ones begun. Um, I don't think any other game I've played has so beautifully illustrated natural player choice. All too often in games, you know what you're choosing. You know, I'm playing it good. I'm playing it evil in this. I honestly just followed my heart and did from the beginning and did so in that conversation. My plan was to burn no bridges so that I could continue to play this game and experience everything it has to offer but give you guys an amazing conclusion. I know I've burned one bridge, but I hope I've managed to give you that conclusion. Guys, thank you so much for watching my Let's Play series of Fallout 4. This, I think, is the last episode. There's not too much more I can do um, without cutting parts of the game off to myself, and I just cut one off right there. And I can't let that happen. I love this Let's Play series and this character I've created, but continuing to play out this game is more important to me than getting quickly to a finish. Guys, I love you for watching this series, and I have lots of amazing new stuff coming uh, to the channel in the very near future, and uh, that's going to do it for this one. That's going to do it for this series. I'm Unite the Clans, and I'll see you all in my next video. Geeks, what is going on? The Unite the Clans here, back in your life. For the first time in a long time, and I'm back in your life with some Fallout 4. I know I am late to the game, guys.